Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and uh, welcome to my weekly shop family meal planning video for this week. I haven't done one of these in a while and it just sort of took me, the moment took me this morning so I just went for it. As you can see it's been a lazy morning and we've just gone out to Aldi and got everything we need for the week. It was an interesting trip to Aldi. Leo spent the majority of the time screaming because he wanted these cookies that were in the trolley and it was um, eventful. And you did run in? Yeah, and he ran away from me. You did run in, it was naughty. Yeah. But hey ho. So, before I went to Aldi, and this is what I do every time I do a food shop, I did my weekly meal planner. So I got this magnetic family meal planner from Amazon a little while ago. So it's just a giant magnet and it's straight onto my fridge and it comes with this pen. And before I go to Aldi, I'll just think about what we're gonna eat in the week. And it just stops me buying extra stuff and sort of making it up as I go along and I go with, you know, a bit of a plan. Make some notes here of stuff that I know that I need and I'll plan the week here. We are on holiday from Friday for the weekend. We're going to Centre Parks. It's quite a short week for us. So I've got spag bowl on the Monday. We do a slow cooker curry on a Tuesday. It's like our little tradition after Leo gets home from nursery. Wednesday, Leo has his dinner at nursery and me and Clint are gonna have a nice adult dinner together. Thursday, pizza night. Purely because I work on a Thursday. We all get home quite late, we're all tired, and it's just so easy. And then Friday we're off. So that is what my family meal planner looks like, and that's what I try to do before I go to the shop. And now I'll show you what I got from Aldi. I spent under 50 pounds today. I think it was like 47 pounds, and I got quite a lot, even though we're only home for four days this week. So I will share with you guys now what I got. So let's start over here in Meat Corner. I got two of these beautiful looking fillet steaks. This is for Wednesday night when me and Clint have an adult dinner together. Their steaks at Aldi are so good and these were reduced to like four pounds each. I also got, even though it wasn't on the meal planner, excuse my son, even though they weren't on the meal planner, I got some fish cakes and some of these cod nuggets i thought they would be good like emergency lunch things just to have in the fridge um if i'm caught short then these are easy to just serve up here is the lean mince for our spaghetti bolognese and here is the diced chicken for our curry night here are the pizzas for our pizza night now normally they have these really cute mini pizzas that i give to leo but they didn't have any so i got two like adult pizzas for me and clint and then I had to get a big one for Leo because they didn't have the baby one. So I'm not expecting him to eat all that. Although he might, who knows. Basmati rice for the curry night and curry sauce as well. It's so easy. My friend Lucy put this on her story because I put it on mine and everyone's been messaging me like mad since saying that they're doing this slow cooker meal. And honestly, it is just so easy. I am not a chef by any stretch of the imagination. I just put in raw diced chicken, I put in curry sauce and I put it in the slow cooker. That's literally it. Penne for um, bolognese night. These are so good. I always get these potato wedges to go with our steaks because they are so yummy. Naan bread to go with curry night obviously as well. So fruit and veg corner over here. I got some bananas. I got some of these. These are so cute. Wonky strawberries. These are always the cheapest ones because I guess they're like the wonky ones. Whatever that means. But I didn't want to get a huge box because obviously we're going away. Also got Aldi do these great like mini punnets of grapes because we never get through a whole punnet before they go off. So these mini ones are really good. Broccoli, carrots and some easy peel satsumas. Also a tin of chopped tomatoes for the bolognese. Bread because my son is obsessed with bread he has toast every morning he has sandwiches for lunch we go through a lot of bread these are also for emergency sandwiches it's just an easy cheesy sandwich 
This I got for work. These are really great to have in your bag. Um, and I always have one in my bag at work just because I'm a bit funny about drinking water. I know it's really bad. I just don't enjoy water. So if I could squeeze a bit of this into it, it's just much more enjoyable for me. Bad, I know. His Majesty complained this morning that we were out of tea bags or that I don't drink tea. So he has to tell me when we're out of tea bags. I can't just magically know. But he told me we're out of tea bags, so more tea bags for you, Clint. Cocoa Pops, milk, obviously. Grated cheese. I love to buy pre grated because it makes life easier. Leo also loves these for lunch as well. Just these little cheddar sticks. He really likes those. I got some face wipes for me. These are like less than a pound and they're actually pretty impressive. I, I tend to wash my face properly if I can, but if I'm in a rush, these are really good. Toilet roll, I mean, that's not that interesting, is it? Naughty snacks, I got Snickers for me. I got fig rolls for Clint and these safari snacks for Leo. These were the culprit of the tantrum in Aldi because he wanted some. And mini cheddars for him as well. Also, granulated sugar because I accidentally bought caster sugar for Clint's tea and he was just absolutely horrified. So I've redeemed myself there. Hello. Hello. You helping? Hmm? Yeah. So there you go. That is what this week's family meal planner looks like and what our family shop looks like for less than 50 pounds. That's Mama's gonna take that to work. Oh, uh, excuse me. Be careful. This one is being hard work this morning, so I better go and um, I don't even know, try and get through the rest of the morning. You are being hard work this morning. Don't forget to subscribe before you go, my lovelies. If it's your first trip to my channel, then hi. Hey. Always open my purse. That is a sign of things to come, isn't it? And I'll see you guys in my next video. You're gonna say bye. Bye. Are you going to wish me luck? Say good luck, mummy. Wow. Oh, wow, yeah, good luck.